us Mr. Balbi Tekta, who is the Chairman of uh, Himachal Pradesh Board of School Education. Uh, welcome to Mr. Uh, to Knowledge Exchange Goa, Mr. Tekta. Uh, we will uh, like to know from you how has uh, IT uh, initiatives been taken in the school education uh, department in the state of Himachal Pradesh. Himachal Pradesh uh, uh, has uh, pioneered in the in the IT area, and uh, it has won several awards at national level. It's a very IT savvy state, and uh, probably it is uh, one of few states in the country which is uh, in a big way into the IT applications uh, with respect to e-governance, uh, with respect to uh, applications of uh, the IT into various areas, and uh, particularly in the education sector, I, I must say a lot has been done, and uh, IT has been introduced in a phased manner in various schools and also in the education board which I am heading today. Uh, so, would you like to discuss a few uh, initiatives that are in the pipeline and are uh, involving um, intensive IT implementation into it? In school education board, uh, we are uh, introduced several uh, IT initiatives for last two years uh, since I have taken over in the present government. Uh, we are, uh, we have introduced uh, online applications for uh, registration of students for entrance into various exams. We have uh, digitized old records where uh, the facility uh, we are providing to uh, the old uh, students who want to take their registration certificates and uh, other records from the board. Now we are also into uh, into uh, setting up of uh, various modules for the working of the office, where we want to introduce more transparency and uh, bring in efficiency. As uh, we say, uh, uh, the IT. Uh, as a tool we want to uh, introduce for, uh, as I said, uh, for uh, increasing efficiency and bringing more transparency and uh, providing better services and uh, take the services to the doorsteps uh, of uh, every Himachali. Uh, sir, would you like to say something for ELETS uh, for organizing this kind of event wherein all the key stakeholders, IT uh, initiators are uh, under one roof? Yeah, actually I had been in this uh, summit for the last two days and uh, rather this is the third day today. And, uh, and uh, I have a uh, lot of exposure to various IT applications, uh, particularly in education sector and uh, in uh, overall growth of infrastructure, health and uh, other areas. And I wish uh, we could also uh, have a, a summit uh, like this sometime in near future, for which uh, I will pursue this matter with the government. and. Uh, I'm hopeful that uh, uh, this kind of uh, a summit would do uh, a good work in furtherance of uh, the cause of education in the state. Particularly, I would uh, particularly I would uh, uh, like to bring in the growth of uh, Himachal Pradesh in the education sector for last three decades because uh, there had been a large expansion of uh, educational activities in the state with the visionary uh, leadership of uh, the present chief minister 
Shri Veer Bhadra Singh, who is now uh, the Chief Minister of the State for the sixth time, uh, uh, where now the education, uh, educational institutions have now uh, uh, gone to about 17,000 in the state, about 90 uh, colleges and uh, uh, five universities. And for a state like Himachal with a population of 65 lakhs, uh, about 16,000 villages, almost uh, we have a school for every village. And that's a tremendous growth and expansion that has taken place in the sector of uh, education. And now, as the Chief Minister and the present government emphasis, uh, in fact, uh, uh, the Chief Minister, Honorable Chief Minister, is also the Education Minister of the State. So the things are much easier for us in uh, to do something in uh, education sector. And this year, the education budget for the state is uh, 4,400 crores, which is roughly one-fourth of the budget of the state. That shows the priority the government has for education in the state and the concern it has uh, for improving uh, the quality of education. And for which I, I feel uh, the IT is one component, which is uh, the demand of the day. Uh, and uh, surely I think uh, the state governments uh, are thinking now in a big way to do IT applications into the education sector. Thank you, sir. Thanks for your valuable comment.